Good afternoon, guys. This is Lulu, Chef Mashpo. By the way, guys, I have something for you. This is my uh, lunch. Actually, this is my merienda. Lunch and merienda right now. Because I had some, you know, like a bread and fruits earlier. And then I did some things in the That's why I'm vlogging right now. Anyway, guys, this is a cabbage. Normally, I'm always posting cabbage, right? So that's a cabbage and I put on top the egg, which is, is crumbled. And then I add some, you know, like pepper, salt, a little just to, you know, just to uh, feel the, the taste on it. Para pag kinain mo siya, talagang yummy. Okay? And then this is my potato. Ito na yung parang rice ko. Yung vegetable, like yung potato, carrots. So same thing, ni steam ko lang sila para ng cabbage and then nilagyan ko lang ng pepper and salt. Mga bata, do this ah. Mura lang naman to eh. Pag pinagdan kay ni mommy ng lunch, dinner, or anything, just just ask them to prepare like this. Siguro hindi naman naabot ng 100 lahat to eh. Except yung ipon, siguro mga 100 lang naman ang binili ko para I can cook like konti lang naman din yun. Okay? So I steam that. And then, this is the shrimp. Okay, the prawns. By the way, guys, the prawns, actually, in steam ko una. Kasi ganun ako pag nag-fried ng prawns, para wala yung, yung para hindi ba siya masyadong malansa yung, um, yung dating. So, ang ginawa ko, guys, nilagyan ko siya ng a little of uh, hot water. So, in steam ko muna normally. Kasi before I do the, the fried, Binibig, ko muna siya ng water so papatuyuin ko siya and then afterwards doon ko ilalagay yung um, like the pepper ilalagay ko na doon sa shrimp tapos meron din ako ilalagay doon na, na garlic and onion kasi ganun ako mag, mag, ano, mag fried hindi ako basa basa ilalagay ko yung shrimp lalagay ko muna siya ng hot water para hindi mag ano, yung, yung, yung alam mo na yung taste ng fish and then ng shrimp para hindi mag-amoy. So, I do normally like that. Okay? So, same thing guys. Simple lang. Gisa lang. Onion, garlic, and then pepper. Uh, instead of vinegar, nilag nilalagay ko lagi kalamansi guys. Kasi, iba yun eh. Alam ng sister ko yan. Alam ng mga friends ko. If I cook, alam nila ko na taste. Okay? So, this is my lunch and merienda. Pasensya na kayo sa background na kasi ano to, mabuhay lane eh. So that's why ang daming dumada ng mga sasakyan mm -hmm. dito. And then, so this will be my um, merienda. Lunch and merienda right now. So I guess guys, it's better if you, you know, like what I told you, if you do plating before you eat, whatever it is, kahit ano pa yan, kahit tuyo, tapos may fried rice kayo, siguro gagawa ko ng mga breakfast ng ganun. Yung mga dilis, tuyo, para at least makita ng ibang mga, you know, ibang nationality na married to foreigner na talaga yun yung pambansang food natin pag breakfast. I'm gonna do that. Anyway guys, obviously, no, you know what's going on right now in Manila, Philippines. So, I have lots of friends. They're asking me if kamusta daw ako, family ko, friends ko and all. I told them, you know, we're thankful in Manila but some in Manila places, medyo binaha. Kami naman natakot lang kami sa, sa hangin. Although may mga bubong talaga, nagliparan dito. Yung gate, nasira yung gate namin sa bahay, sa kabila. Kasi nga, diba, the moment parking yun, hindi pa namin napapagawa. But God is so good. Okay lang. Kaya lang, guys, I just wanna, you know, just wanna pray. Let us, let us pray, guys, for the, for other provinces like yung Cagayan. Kasi hindi naman ganun daw totally yun. And then, yung Marikina, yung, you know, Marikina, Cagayan. Lahat ng mga outside pro the province natin, grabe na. Parang nagiging, nagiging water ng buong, ano, buong Philippines na hindi mo maintindihan, which is sana wag naman. Siguro guys, I guess, we need to, we need to change ourselves. Kung alam mo siguro, kung yung personality natin, we just, we just move on, we just add whatever, it's, it's better for all of us. Kung, like what I said sa other vlogs ko, kung mabuti ka guys, pagpatuloy mo yung kabutihan mo. Kung medyo sumalingot ka, sumalingot, sumaliwa, how do you call that? Opposite yung ginawa mo. 
bumalik ka sa dating maganda kasi guys, God knows whatever do, we're doing right now. Honestly, tama yung sinabi ng magulang natin. Kung ano yung tinanim mo, ayun na nga niin mo. Kung ano yung ginawa mong kabutihan, papalit rin ang kabutihan yun. So, sabi nga nila, what goes around comes around, okay? So, siguro in a relationship, whether husband, wife, whether girlfriend, boyfriend, whether other relationship, like opposite sex, siguro pag alam nating mali, guys, huwag na lang nating gawin. Kasi like me, no? I'll tell you the truth, guys. Ah. Kaya siguro naging ganito, kasi I spend my time with my father. Kuya, eh, since wala na sila, talaga I spend all my time with my family. Alam na mga kapatid ko yan, shout out to them. Kasi sinabi ng magulang namin talaga na, anak, like me, sinabi niya, Lou, kung maghahanap ka ng boyfriend or mag-aasawa ka, o boyfriend mo na, huwag daw ako pipili ng merong asawa o may girlfriend. Kasi ayokong, ayokong mangyari din sa akin yun. So, kumbaga, pag alam nyo na guys na hindi na maganda yung relation, maski mayaman yung boyfriend mo, girlfriend mo, kung alam mo naman, kung alam mo naman engaged na siya, ba't ka pa manggugulo, ba? Diba? Guys, I'm just telling this lang, kasi this is part of our lives, ba? Diba? So, siguro, maski opposite sex, pag alam mo may relation na, wag ka na lang, wag ka na maki, ano pa, maki eme eme Diba? Kasi ano yun eh, walang lihim na hindi nabubunyag guys. Totoo yun. So siguro, para sa akin no, I just wanna tell this to everybody. Kahit sino ka pa, pag alam mo may girlfriend, may boyfriend, wag ka nang umema ba? Kasi magkakagulo talaga lahat. So I guess kung sino man yun, siguro magkaroon naman sana ng konting, you know what I mean? Kaya tulad ngayon guys, tignan mo. Ang dami mong in-invest, ang dami mong biniling properties, luxuries, tumira ka sa magandang bahay. 